Hey Mike, I want to go through all the exercises at once. We start with a squat in a row. Set up, feet shoulder width apart, arms at length. You're going to squat 90 degrees, up, squeeze those shoulder blades, stick that chest out. One more time. 90 degrees, knees stay over feet, squeeze row, let it out, squat. Right there. From there we go to the single arm reach. Lower your cable, opposite hand and foot, you're hinging from the hips and not twisting. This knee stays right over this foot, so it looks just like this. Then you switch hands, go the other side. From there, we're going to move to the single arm press. Bring them up, reach over the cable, the leg goes back on the arm that's pressing. Keep the shoulder square, you're pressing straight out, right there. Rotate that hand as you push forward. We don't want any movement this way, you want to stay nice and tall. From there, Mike, we go to resisted rotation. You and I have done this before. You're going to bring that cable straight out in front of you. Everything stays square. No swaying with the hips, no leaning with the shoulders. You're holding right there out in front of you. If that's too intense, shorten that lever and bring it toward your body. And then slowly work it out, staying nice and stable, getting no deviation of the posture. Right there. Belly button's drawn in and you hold, I believe we've got 20 seconds on the sheet. We'll finish. On the cable with a reverse fly, take your handles off. Very little weight. Grab the cable across, one foot forward, one back to keep the pelvis neutral, and pull apart. From there, you're going to pretend like I have two dumbbells. You're going to lay on the ground with two dumbbells. Lift your hips into a bridge. Dumbbells are here. And you're going to press straight up and together. Elbows touch, up and together. All the while squeezing those hamstrings and glutes, pressing with those dumbbells. That's your circuit three times through, Mike. 